Durodyne. The greatest name in sheet metal necessities, revolutionizing the HVAC industry. Our innovative Dynamate J-Flange 4-bolt connection streamlines HVAC ductwork assembly, delivering reliable results and reduced labor costs. This instructional video demonstrates specific assembly and installation procedures for rectangular duct connection systems. Durodyne's Dynomate J-Flange system is expertly designed to strengthen duct wall and connect duct sections together. This line of product meets SMA CNA Rigidity Class J standards for transverse steel joints and includes an integrated sealant pocket for a secure, airtight fit. The Dynamate system consists of flange roll formed to rigid tolerance criteria, precision stamped corner pieces, metal and PVC cleat available in 6 inch or 10 foot lengths, and butyl or neoprene gasket developed to satisfy the specialized needs of gasketing rectangular duct in an HVAC system. Duradyne components ensure reliable results every time. The first step is to cut the Dynamate J flange. Using a chop saw with a 3 horsepower motor or band saw with a metal cutting blade helps to ensure a clean edge. Cut the flange 1 and 5 16 inch shorter than the duct dimensions. This allows for the additional length of the corner pieces after they are inserted while making the frame. We recommend a metal cutting blade to cut the flange. Never use an abrasive blade, as heat from the cutting process can melt the mastic and leave burrs, creating corner insertion problems. Cut the flange with the spine pointing up to prevent chips from falling into the mastic, creating seating problems. Before assembling the frame, make sure the DOMJ corner pieces are inserted with the stamped lettering visible from the outside of the frame. Insert the corner into each end of the two longer pieces to form two insets. The tapered ends of the Duradyne Speed J corner allow for easy insertion without opening the ends of the flange. Next, insert the insets into each end of the two shorter sections of flange. The frame is now complete. To install the completed DOMJ frame, start at one corner and seat the frame onto the duct using a mallet. If the dynamate corner or the longitudinal lock seam get caught, tap the frame outwards to slide it past the duct corner. When seating the frame, it is critical that the duct wall be seated all the way into the integral mastic pocket of the dynamate J flange. Establish metal to metal contact along the full perimeter. Once the frame has been seated properly, fasten the frame to the ductwork. Use a C-clamp to hold the frame to the duct wall when fastening with sheet metal screws. This helps establish solid contact between components and a secure attachment. The frame must be fastened to the duct within 3 quarters of an inch of the end of the flange at each corner. See the installation and assembly manual for additional screw spacing and fastening instructions based on duct design considerations. Once the frame has been seated properly, fasten the frame to the ductwork. Begin in one corner and work in one direction around the perimeter of the duct until the frame is completely attached to the duct walls. The next step is to install the gasket. On one frame, apply a 2 to 3 inch strip of gasket on the four exposed corners. Then, on the mating frame, apply a single strip of gasket completely around the inside edge, starting at the center. The gasket must cover the exposed edge of the duct section and the gap between the duct wall and the corner. Be sure that the Dynomate J flange is free of oils and debris. Do not stretch the gasket when applying at the corners. It is important that the gasket be positioned in an arc to cover the three critical points in each corner. Press the gasket firmly into contact with the raw edge and corner assembly of the duct. Some gasket will protrude into the airstream. For an airtight seal, use premium Durodyne butyl or neoprene gasket, depending on your application. To join the flange, carefully align the mating frames before they touch as the gasket adheres on contact. A drift pin can be used for alignment, and a vice grip can be used to compress the gasket at the corners for installation of 3 8 carriage bolts and nuts. Alternatively, instead of drift pins and vice grips, try the Durodyne Easy Connector System. Easy Connector is a unique duct connection system that can cut labor costs in the field by more than half. This system reduces installation time. Simply drive the proprietary Easy Bolt into the patented teardrop-shaped corner cutout 
using an impact driver. This bolt pulls the connection together and locks it into place without a locking nut. The self-piloting screw tip aligns the corner sections, and the one-piece swivel driver features a built-in magnet that aligns the easy bolt in place for easy assembly. The easy quad corner is compatible with most flange systems, eliminating the need to stock multiple corners. Easy bolts are available in 5 16th and 9 16th sizes, with 1 inch or 1.5 inch lengths to fit all our easy connector corners. You're now ready to apply the cleat. Snap a 6 inch piece of either metal or PVC cleat over the mating frame using the following recommendations. For half inch to 2 inch static pressure, use one piece on 24 inch centers. For 2 inch to 3 inch static pressure, use one piece on 18 inch centers. For 4 inch to 6 inch static pressure, use one piece on 12 inch centers. For over 10 inch static pressure, use a continuous cleat. For a weatherproof duct connection, install a full length one piece cleat to the duct flange joint to prevent water from collecting on the gasket. Your connection is now complete. The Dynomate J system and Easy Connector are engineered for virtually any commercial and industrial applications. At Durodyne, we pride ourselves on our comprehensive customer service. Please contact our certified specialists for information and instructions on all our HVAC system applications, making the job more reliable, faster, and efficient. Durodyne is the greatest name in sheet metal necessities for all your HVAC installations.